see can not see it properly I've made the front bit of the carcass so that's two long bits two short bits all screwed together which wasn't too difficult so I just need to make the back part the same like you need it square don't we so 78 78 is 78 centimetres times two that sounds easy enough doesn't it right cut that out Irritating. Remind me never to do a bank conversion again in case I forget. 78. Will you let me see a stroke? So, they should be the same size. Yeah. Oh, no, one's bigger than another. Oh, no, they're all right. That's good. Ah, that is again. Oh, always. <laughs> no rest for the wicked. Let me just do this and then I'll. No, no problem. <sighs> Extra pair of hands. Oh, so, I didn't realise you were here. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Couple of them there. Oh, thank you. That and that. Excellent. So these little frames you're making. Yeah, so I've done this one. Right. So I'll need, um, I will need a bit in the middle or Well, it depends where everything's going, doesn't it? Yeah, wherever you're going to decide if you're making a cupboard, the door's going to be here. You yeah. need to put a piece of wood between that and the bottom bit. Yeah. So that screws like that has done. Yeah. So that's yeah. one section. Yeah. Then wherever the other sections. Yeah. 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 Then you need to repeat it on the back. Yeah. So whatever you do on the front, you repeat on the back. Yeah. 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 And then if you decide to put a shelf so far down measure down screw through there and do the same on the other yeah, yeah. and then it's all and then you've read the frame you just put it into position and screw it in the wall yeah all done and dusted <laughs> it's definitely easier doing it this way rather than screwing it to the floor and then having a jig into bits yeah because and... this is what this is where i do it i'm yeah. not a joiner but by doing it this way you don't have to worry about jigging anything oh and all this is done now yeah Ooh, oh hey doesn't it look good it's all right yeah yeah oh you, well are you not going to criticise me, Graham? Would I do that? <laughs> no. One, one, one. All I was going to say is, you know, you got your sander. Yeah. Just take that little edge off. Yeah, yeah. So it rounds smooth. Rounds it. Yeah, it could do. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's just a just a just a suggestion. <laughs> not telling you what to do. <laughs> but no, as you say, it works, doesn't it? Doing it this way. Yeah, it does. It's a lot easier. Because then, when you have got your two identical pieces, put them together. Yeah. Then look at where you want to put your fingers. So when it's crossed. all screwed, screwed to the, the wall, screwed to the floor, job done. Fingers crossed they will be identical. <laughs> they will be. I have faith in you, Carol. Guest appearance. Right. Have I ain't going to work on it. needs to be screwed from the other side. You have to turn it round. You can't do it that way. <laughs> Okay, I just you, you can't see. You can't see. Just take my word for it, it's moving about all over the shop. You still here? Yes. <laughs> I am. Well, it's looking good. Thank you. Oh my god, this pissed me right off. Do it over. It's the other end, you just want to stay still. Right, you'll need to go away because I'll just get annoyed. Alright. <laughs> I'm such a friendly, friendly, hospitable person, aren't I? What? Bloody hell. I can't do it like this. Just uh, locking it in place, hopefully. Oh, that's the one that I've got. Yeah, that's the one I've got. Yeah, yeah,
save you to haul that still because it's it's been a pillock. It just keeps tipping over, and I can't I keep it still. Right. Thank you. I'm just. I might stubborn. I'll struggle and struggle and struggle. I struggle the money there. I know. I know. <laughs> It's because I'm just like, I'll do it myself. I can do it myself. It's like I've got to prove something. I just think I'm not here. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> All right. Yes, thank you. Okay, then. Thanks for your help. No problem. You know where I am? I do. Yeah, Fair enough. So I've got my two frames, but of course, as usual, I've done something wrong. Because one has to go at the back, and we've got a wheel arch, haven't we? So there has to be a gap for the wheel arch. I can't have just two pieces like this, can I? Because how's that going to fit at the back? The front's fine, but not at the back. Oh, God. Every time. You know, I, I can think I'm doing well. And then I realise I've done something stupid. I've made... Obviously, I'd, I videoed the other day, I can't remember now. It's two days ago, I can't remember what I said. But I've um, made these frames. I've realised, though, that the the fridge won't go there. That's why I've drawn it, because it's going to be too high for that frame. But that's fine, I can put the cooker there. Because the cooker's only 12 inch uh, from top to bottom height wise 12 inch um i can put the fridge put the fridge here i can still make a platform uh it will be off the floor not as far off the floor i'd want it to be really because that the wheel arch with the platform is about 10 inch whereas this is going to have to be about eight inch a couple of inches a couple of inches can make all the difference <laughs> yeah so It'll be better than being, like, say, right down on the floor. Because I can sit here anyway and get things out if I need to. And then I suppose I could put the sink there. I'm not sure exactly. This is why planning is so important. I, as I've said before, I'm not a planner. I just can't be bothered with that process. Turn you around. Yeah, I, I just can't be bothered. But I can certainly see the value in it because you just end up doing things twice if you don't plan things. <laughs> At least twice. So, yeah, anyway. But then you learn from your mistakes as well, don't you? Hopefully. If you get it right the first time, every time, where's the fun in that? <laughs> so I've just, I've just screwed that to the floor just, just so I can keep it upright. I needed it 20 inches across because that's the depth of my cooker. It's 20 inch. Look, that's going to the window because I'll have the work surface going up to the window, I think. We'll have to do now. Well, I don't have to do. No, I don't, yeah, I'm going to do. So I don't want this coming out any further because it's like, yeah, it's the big bus. But once all this is built, I've just got this bit of walkway. I mean, this, obviously this is as a bed, so I'll take this out anyway. And um, that will make it seem a little bit more spacious. What, 20 is 50, what, 51? 51 centimetres. Um, yes, so I might better get the big sink that I want. I wanted a bigger one because the one I've got is not really big enough. Um, I mean, I've managed, obviously, because you do, but I'd like something bigger. That's what she said. Oh, shut up, woman. Right, so I've done that. I, I, I may end up asking for help with this because it's not as straightforward, I guess, as building seating or that. Well, I've managed, haven't I? I've done both those. So, you know, maybe I can do it. Depends how long I want to take doing it. Time's getting on, isn't it? I would like to be moving in here soon, so let's see. Is I don't use screws that long enough. Well, like when I was putting the frame, you know, when I was putting the frame, frame together, 
I didn't use screws that were long enough and it was all wobbling all over the shop. So they need to be long enough. That's not, it's too long. Well, that's not long enough. God's sakes. Oh, I'm gonna have to go out and get some more screws. Crying out loud. Anyway, I just. Well, that's not bad, that's not bad. Yeah, that's not a bad angle. Okay, so I've got that, like that. Oh, do you know I spend more time looking for shit than I do all else? I'll just put some glue on this. I just had a piece that fit. All right. But glue ain't gonna be enough. I can get those little L-shaped brackets, I might do, under there to strengthen it. But I want to ideally put a screw into these end bits. But there's already a screw going down the middle there, so I don't know how that's going to work. Give it a go. So I just think this screw, if I put a screw in this way, it's going to hit this screw. I don't know how Graham's done it, because he didn't use a jig that he's done it, he's managed to do it. That's not doing it, is it? That didn't work. It didn't fucking work. Do one there. Do it that side. That side into there. I don't know. I honestly don't know how he's done this. Might be right obvious. You know, you might be looking at it and thinking, if you can see from over there, of course, that it's right obvious. What I need to do, but I can't work it out. Bloody awkward is this? Well, it's going to come out the other side, isn't it, Carl? Yes. Might like be better. Oh, because that's the same size. Right, I got a new piece of wood because I've fucked up the last bit. And I've done jigs. I have done jigs. So that is. Fairly sturdy now. I think that should be all right. I hope. <laughs> I gotta do the same. I had to unscrew it all though to be able to get into this angle because it was too close to the wall, so I've had to move it away. So I need to screw back in after I've done that end. I'll, I'll jig that bit as well. Yes, that's what I'm doing then. 